give them bread hands Say what's up America Half of you should know me right Other half a replica Shout out to my What's going on guys, it's Strategic and I'm basically going to be bringing you an informational video about Black Ops 2 and uh, people that are having problems downloading it. Um, so recently they've released Black Ops 2 for backwards compatibility on the Xbox One and people have been going crazy over the best Call of Duty in my opinion. Um, they want to download it and everything but when it comes to downloading it they're having problems. It usually stops at 10% and um, they don't know what to do. So in this video, I'm going to be uh, explaining, going through all the process with video and everything um, to show you what to do uh, and if this happens to you. It's really simple. Uh, all you have to do is power off your Xbox. But anyway, let's get into the video. Alright guys, so first off, of course, you're going to need the Black Ops 2 Xbox 360 disc, and you're going to put that in your Xbox, and then this is going to come up on the screen, just click install. Okay, now you're going to go down to your queue, and you're going to see that it is installing. You're just going to let that install all the way to uh, 10%. Okay guys, what you see here is all the downloadable content, maps, weapon skins, and all that other good stuff. Um, I'm just showing you that I have installed it and that it is working and that you should not have a problem with um, this downloadable content when downloading it. Uh, the map that I was playing on in the beginning of the video was a downloadable map, so you shouldn't have any problems downloading these whatsoever. Okay guys, so as you see, it just reached 10% and it's starting to bug out just a little bit and the uh, megabytes per second just disappeared and uh, it's starting to glitch up and I should get a notification saying the installation has stopped like right here. Uh, so what you're going to do whenever you get that message, you're going to go to your Xbox and you're going to click the power button and hold it down. Make sure you hold it down until it completely shuts off. Once the power button has gone off, that indicates that you have restarted your Xbox. And now, just wait a second and turn it back on. Also, turn your controller on because you will be needing that later. So, whenever you restart it, your Xbox screen should look like this. It's just a reboot logo for the Xbox One in case that you have restarted your console and it is just preparing your desktop for you okay guys so at the home screen over to the right you see that black ops 2 is installing and it's at 10 percent so you're just going to click on that it's going to bring you to your games and apps and there you're going to see that Black Ops 2 is downloading and it says its installation stopped and it's bugging out a little bit. But don't worry guys because this, this is working and it's going to be completely fine. It's going to download. You'll know as soon as it will reach 11%. But don't worry about it because it will download. Okay guys, so as you see, it's at 11%. Once it reaches 11%, you've known that it works. So now you can just sit there and let it load for the rest of the day or however long it takes. So now as you see, it's downloaded and I'm just going to sign into my profile. Okay guys, so once you sign into your profile, um, you can go ahead and go into Black Ops 2 going to need to sign in before you go into black ops 2 otherwise it's going to be a more tedious process because uh it's going to ask you to sign into your xbox 360 account and then you'll have to sign in 
from the home screen of the Xbox One. So you'll be doing two sign-ins rather than one. Um, so here is the startup screen for the Xbox 360. That's when you know that all of this has worked. I mean, of course, it'll take just a few minutes though. So guys, just give it a second to load and um, it'll be great. So after about a minute of waiting, you're going to see that it's going to um, show that you've signed in to Xbox Live at the bottom right here. Um, this is actually when I signed in uh, to another console. So now you're just going to click on Xbox Live or whatever you're playing. This is multiplayer because that's how I have it set. Um, and there you guys go. So you're in Black Ops 2. You can do whatever now. And it's just like the regular game. So anyways guys, I'm going to wrap up this video here. I hope you enjoyed and I hope this really helped. Uh, so please don't forget to leave some feedback, some like, subscribe, and uh, comment for future videos on what you like to see in future content. And help me improve my channel. Just um, go down there and leave me any comments or any questions that you have. Uh, and I will see you in future videos guys. So thanks for watching and I'm out. I'ma hit it from the back, I'ma pull up on a nigga with it